Hi guys, uh, just a quick one before I get into the main video, um, just to give a, a bit of brief explanation of where I am, um, as in when I'm testing the Diamond BB7V. Uh, part of it is here uh, at my QTH, and then I, I go over to Wales, uh, to my parents in South Wales, here in the UK, and um, I have to go into the outdoors, as in the potting shed in the garden, and that's where I set up my equipment. So um, you'll see me also uh, having a couple of QSOs um, using the Zygu X6100 and the FT991 uh, using the Diamond BB7V antenna. Um, also, uh, you might also notice I had a QSO on my 7300. Um, I didn't realise until the very last minute that um, there was also a contest, so there was slight confusion with the QSO I had. But but there again, he did hear me and uh, he gave me a five and nine. So uh, sit back, relax and uh, enjoy. Welcome back to the channel and belated Happy New Year to you all. I know it's been a while. Um, I've uh, purchased myself, I've had it some time now, um, the Diamond BB7V, um, which is the uh, the vertical version of um, the uh, BB6WS. Um, I had the wire version, which I've done a review on as well. Um, the big bulbous matching unit is the same. And um, uh, people that also uh, subscribe to me now I'm in a very compromised location um, just looking uh, to the north there um, that's a retaining wall uh, that's ground level at the back of me with another house on top as well and uh, my only sort of clear path really is to the west um, but anyway I've uh, buried a bit of uh, some old, a cut off of some scaffold pole into the ground. Uh, I've not concreted it in, uh, it's in by about uh, two feet, but uh, that'd be more than adequate for this anyway. So um, I've disconnected my DX Commander and just ran some RG213 um, to the bottom here. Um, yeah, and uh, I'm gonna go over to my mother's in Wales and take this with me and um, if I get time, because I've got some uh, errands to do and jobs to do for for my uh, for, for my parents, um, I'll uh, try and make some contacts. And um, I'm going to set myself a challenge: is I'm going to use no more than no more than ten watts. So um, and see what contacts I can make on 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 uh, this antenna. Some people say it's just one big uh, dummy load, but uh, We'll see anyway. Um, uh, it'd be interesting to see. So what I'm actually going to do is, um, I'm not going to show you these fixings here. You get a fixing kit, uh, but if you've got this in a more permanent uh, location and uh, you're not going to be taking it up and down, uh, you do get uh, some fixing, uh, fixing screws and a bit of self-amalgamating tape. Uh, and, and some other little bits as well but um, you can actually uh, put this up by just simply uh, twisting and uh, locking in place so I'll cut over to that for you right let's hope I'm recording <laughs> right so I'm going to telescope this up you can see uh, the, you know the the uh, structure um, and these you'd expect well I thought these would be very thin um, walled aluminium sections but they're not they're pretty thick um, I mean just the tolerance just if I let go of this middle section now you'll see it's just it's just it's just uh, the air in there so th there's a nice tolerance to them a nice close tolerance right so um, yeah so top section first I'll just show you um, it's literally just Give a bit of up tension until you feel it lift, twist, down, and the same again. This section now, just lift up, twist, down, next section. Up, twist, 
first down. Next section. Up, twist, down. Up, twist, down. There you go. Now, to be honest, this is I this is ideal for me as well. So, um, as you can see up there as well, I've got my Diamond D Triple Seven um, and my long wire there as well in my very small garden. So, anyway, let's head into the shack and um, see how this performs. Two Echo One Hotel Kilo Oscar. Two Echo One Hotel Kilo Oscar five nine two seven. Hotel Kilo Oscar Two Echo One Hotel Kilo Oscar. Thank you for twenty seven or five nine Bravo call zero two. Yeah, five nine two seven zero one. Roger, QSL. Okay, 78, Two Whiskey One, Hotel Kilo Oscar. Two Whiskey One? Yeah, Two Whiskey One, Hotel Kilo Oscar Portable, over. Five nine zero zero one five nine zero zero one. Thank you. Good luck. Italy Kilo Three, Uniform November America contest. India Kilo Three, United November Alpha contest. Just to show you, the Zygu is connected. This is the station um, I had the short QSO with. There's the uh, RG58, as you can see. There it is. Correction, zero, zero, two. What's my number? Zero, zero, two. Number two, thank you. A five nine, five two zero, QSL. QSL, good luck. Thank you, Mike Zero, Delta X-ray radio contact. America three Yankees. Radio Alpha three Yankee, five nine, five two one. What I'm going to do next is do an SWR check uh, using the 7300 on um, most of the HF bands. So what we're coming up are just some stills um, of each band showing the SWR reading, uh, which you'll notice around here, SWR, um, on the stills that are coming up. Hi guys, thanks for watching and um, I'll leave a link in the description of where you can actually source this antenna and I'll catch you in the next one, 7-3.